All right, guys and gals, we have the FAA and 5G congressional hearing that happened yesterday at the time of this recording. So that would have been February 3rd. I watched part of it. It was horrible. It was a total joke, littered with uninformed representatives with no knowledge on the matter. Uh, both Democratic and Republic, uh, Republican representation made a mockery of the process. Uh, Democrats from Oregon, Republicans from Texas, total political chicanery. Anyways, forward looking at the C band, we have an issue. There's still going to be problems between the aviation airline industry, uh, C band with the carriers. And this is going to spill over as the licenses and the operations around airports is not really solved. All right. So issues with the FAA and the airline industry continue. Claims of airplane radio altimeter interference with the C band 5G. Radio technologies, 90% of planes have been cleared of any type of risk. They have been certified and they are acceptable. Uh, now we have 100 pilot reports of quote unquote possible interference. This is something I don't understand. How is there possible interference? Why can't we confirm interference or you know disprove interference? Why is it possible? I don't understand. Anyways. Political ploys are ongoing through all of this nonsense. Uh, there's a lot of fear mongery that was going on during this live stream. Planes falling from the sky continued from these politicians and lobbyists. Uh, some quotes that I remember, wireless carriers are not re um, regulated, and it's why we have crappy service. That was from the Democrat from Oregon. Uh, carriers aren't used to pla uh, planning for the worst. That was from the FAA, Steve's Dix uh, Steve Dixon. Uh, they also went on to say this is why we have you know, crappy service, <laughs> um, carriers, uh, you know, the, this is the thing about this. Why would the carriers be willing to risk planes being taken down <clears throat> by these uh, radio altimeters or radio altimeters having interference from 5G waves? Why would the carriers want to be responsible for that? It would be on them, right? So they're not just willy-nilly doing this, but that's how they pretended to act. On the late solution, uh, quote, we needed data from the carriers. They were keeping it from us. Turns out the airline industry actually did not ask for it until November. So the FAA refused to mention this, but that is important to note because they tried to spin the narrative that the carriers were holding out information and data that they needed. All right, so let's just put that out there. Confirmed, no interference has been identified officially, and this is according to the FAA. There are... 40 plus year old altimeters that are going to be affected apparently those will need modification we're talking about probably filter upgrades especially they mentioned helicopters i think that's going to be a real an issue anyways money for altimeters how much we talking no one wants to disclose it that's nice uh they want money for uh for these altimeters and i guess they're going to be reaching to the fcc out of the 81 billion dollars that was generated in the auction that's what they probably want to see used to retrofit the altimeters all in all do you guys really think that phones are going to take down planes this is a total charade we've got negligence we've got incompetence we've got an industry that's reaching for a handout we've got political chicanery that is ongoing may physics win and physics we trust let's go ahead and hashtag physics here all of this undermines the fcc of course which is the overseer of these types of radio transmission concerns and um you know chairman War uh, rosenworcel the uh fcc chairwoman nowhere to be found through all this that's nice anyways your thoughts and opinions welcome down below you are the voice of the people of the smt nation let your voice be heard please do like share and subscribe uh turn on the bell notifications to never miss an upload email address twitter handle in the description box as well as my patreon page support us there get early access to content and exclusives not found anywhere else and discounts and promos on los mobile just for supporting us we out this piece. Peace.